Alright, so I'm not on stream right now. I'm gonna get started on this on video. Either way, we're gonna get started here on E. If you remember, this was the teaser. Um, and the level that it's gonna be is Epsilon. I don't think anyone actually got this one. The Honestly, the only people that guessed it was Epsilon were people that I just sort of asked what, my, what they thought my E level was gonna be. When I showed them this, they didn't guess it. And that's understandable because this is a reference that probably none of you know about. It is a reference to the Pentazone, a Roblox game that I just found randomly when I was searching on YouTube. The logo is right here. It's like a it's like a fighting game. They have these like five zones. I don't remember which zone is which, but I think it's Alpha, Beta, Gamma, Delta, Epsilon. And one of the, because one of those zones is Epsilon, it's the only one that starts with E, and that was kind of the hint for it. This is the teaser for F. There it is. You can screenshot as always. My initial thoughts on this level, after getting 47%, not really like super initial thoughts, is that it's pretty good. I mean, I don't really have anything against it right now, aside from like the couple choke points. I feel like this could really get me into doing longer levels because while this level isn't like that long comparatively. Uh, it's gonna be one of the longest extremes I've eaten. I think I'm from zero right now. Am I from zero right now? I think I'm from zero right now. Well, even if I'm not from zero, this is a good run. I was from zero! I just got 80! <laughs> I guess I don't need any practice. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god. I probably should practice that ending because I'm actually not that good with the ending. I was actually kind of expecting to die there, surprisingly. And that's like not even really considered one of the hardest parts. I talked about this in my Renovant video. My experience on levels is pretty influential from the song. If it's a good song, I usually have a good time playing a level. This level has an amazing song. This is like one of my favorite songs in GD right here. I don't know, it's just something about it. I really like it. So far, I'm having a good time with this. You could definitely tell from that practice attempt. This is far from the first time I've played this level. I've been practicing this for like the past week. Maybe too much. Oh, what? Oh yeah, Aerial Gleam got verified yesterday. No one's like paying attention to that. <laughs> Maybe because Doggy hasn't uploaded the video yet, people just like don't really know about it. No big GD YouTubers have like even brought it up as far as I've seen. Not even really Doggy, he hasn't like shared it like crazy. I'm gonna do that run one more time just to make sure I'm confident with the ending. And then I guess I'll start playing from zero because <laughs> if I can get 80 on like one of my first attempts of the day, I don't know man. Okay. Oh yeah, there was something I wanted to talk about. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to stream a whole lot anymore. I don't know why, I just don't like streaming, man. I, it just, it takes too much out of me for some reason. I really wanna stream, streaming is fun, but it's hard. I am not good at keeping the conversations going and keeping steady entertainment flow, which is why I typically resort to making videos because in between me saying things and saying other things, there's usually massive pauses and stuff. Like, and if I was on stream, that would be the time where people just leave. Usually chat helps with that, but I don't have enough people in my streams to have a, have a chat that I can talk to the whole stream. It's a lot easier to keep up conversations though when I'm in a call, but that does make playing the game harder even just talking right now not really able to play that well and that's usually why streaming makes levels take longer it's just because you're not completely focused on the level when you're streaming unless you're doing a focus stream obviously wait you can die like that oh that sucks what what the hell Ah, uh, I knew that was gonna happen. I'm actually very surprised I didn't die the first time I got there. Like, one of the most expected deaths. I don't understand why I have such a time with those robot jumps. 
Oh, I got 71. Oh, down. That's unlucky. Oh, come on now. Oh my god. I got 83. Later. Oh my god. The majority of people that I like tell that I play GD, they're like, bro, have you ever beaten Stereo Man? When, when I tell them I beat the 14th hardest level in the game, they were like, what is that, like, can't let go? Shit! Oh my god! My auto defense not. <laughs> that was so random! Oh my god. I don't want to pause in case I exit out. My auto defense. Oh, I, just, I just beat Epsilon! Wait, nice! <laughs> nice. <laughs> Gee, yeah. well, that came out of nowhere. I came out of nowhere, then. yeah. Dude, 4,245 attempts. Not bad. Alright, that was. That was out of nowhere. I mean, I've been playing it like on and off all throughout today, but I literally just just switched calls and just like restarted my session. All right, so I'm gonna do the tier list right now, actually, because this time, contrary to most uh, videos of that of this that I do, I actually do have the thumbnail. I'm actually pretty proud of this thumbnail. So I mean, I don't want to just keep talking highly about every level I play, but Epsilon is really good. It's I think it's the longest extreme I've beaten, except for maybe artificial. I had a ton of fun with it. Practicing it was super good because the ending was pretty fun. I can understand what people say about there being choke points in the level. I had some of the most fun playing this level I've ever had beating an extreme. I think I'm actually gonna put it above artificial ascent. Like, I this is a very hit or miss level. It's a level that you either love or you hate. I love it. That's, that's all I can say. I I. I really enjoyed it. So yeah, I'm gonna put it there. Anyway, that is going to be it for Epsilon. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully I will have done this a lot better than the last video because the last video just kind of got out of hand. So thank you guys so much for watching. This is the teaser for F. Uh, it's, I would say it's harder because I didn't know the references. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.